Y'all doing? How y'all doing? Every time we talk to Chuck, we hear his enthusiasm for the art of Castro and his knowledge of history, all that stuff. When you started your relationship with him, what would you say you were looking for from him? What, you know, um, you know, just I really just wanted a guy, first of all, that you know played the position that they were coaching me with, first of all. So he checked the box there. And then a guy that, you know, would not only teach you the technique, but push like the mentality of a pass rusher in terms of confidence, a go-getter type of mentality, trying to get off, taking that first approach, you know, taking that attack approach and stuff like that. And obviously the te technical parts of it, you know, teaching that part. And then, you know, slowing it down for guys that, you know, are new to the game, like a, like a me or a Jabo or guys that, you know, are athletically inclined, but in terms of skill, you know, they have they have a little bit of ways to go. So, you know, that's those things. Johnny, what's been your uh, first impression of the rookie Tavius Robinson? Now he's been good. He's been real good. He's real strong, tall, doesn't talk a lot, but like, you know, when he talks, he's asking questions and like he receives it well. And then like, um, he'll do a good job of, you know, implementing what you taught him and doing it the right way and stuff like that. So he's a sponge, pretty good, strong, you know, and he's not he's not scared to, you know, make contact. Yeah. Coach Smith just mentioned you've taken on more of a leadership role this year. Do you feel like you have and how do you feel like Uh I mean, you know, I, I appreciate him saying that, but you know, I've I've taken the mentality of, you know, just trying to lead by example. Just trying to, you know, run to the ball, you know, take every rep as if it was my last rep, you know, go hard and everything and try to perfect everything he's teaching me. But, you know, obviously our room's really young. Um, so, you know, we're all, you know, trying to learn everything. But I, I, I like, I accept that and, you know, I thank him for doing that and everything because it, it makes me want to, you know, uh, play harder and take that role of, you know, trying to, knowing other guys are watching me, you know. I've always been the youngest guy in my room. I've always had vets, so it's a different dynamic now. Is that different for you, especially because of Justin Houston before he was the guy that you That's what I'm saying. Like, I, I had Justin, I had JPP, I had other older guys that, Calais, you know, that were always, you know, teaching me what to do. Big Rook, if you guys remember that, all that. So, you know, it's just a different dynamic now. So I'm taking it I'm taking it a different way. Yep. Does, does Chuck have you watching any other pass, pass rushers? Like, you have some attributes like this guy. Like, uh, he does. I don't know if I want to, you know, give them that. But, uh, yeah, he, he has, like, a whole thing in his iPad of, you know, certain names. Like, so he'll have, like, David will have me and stuff that, you know, he thinks that our skills and our attributes match towards. And, you know, we'll try to, you know, mirror and stuff like that. So you'll always see us with our iPads, you know, trying to figure out who, who matches our game. But also he teaches us that, you know, everyone's their own type of rusher. Everyone has their own things they're good at. So you can't mimic everything. You got to find out what you're good at and then take little bits of it out of the pass rushers, you know. Yeah. In terms of things he's taught you, technique-wise, what do you think you've made the biggest strides? Um, in terms of, I'll probably say get off and then um, having a plan at the top of my rush. And then um, what Chuck always talks about, he's like, real! He always saying, real! So, like, at the end of the rush, you got to side scissors, you know, rip. A lot of times I would I would beat my man, but, like, you know, to get my hips cleared enough, I, I didn't do that, and that's because of the rip, like he said. So I'll probably say, like, those two things, yeah. Godfrey, how important is it for you this year to, obviously sacks are important, but for you individually, how important is it for you to put together a strong sack year? Uh, you know, it's real important because, you know, that's obviously, I'm a pass rusher, so that's obviously the most important thing for someone in my position. But I also, I also want to win, you know, so, you know, if, if I know I'm, I'm doing everything that my team, you know, needs me to do, and I'm doing it like how Mike wants me to do it and how Chuck wants me to do it as well, the sack's going to come there. It's going to be coming bunches as well. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Y'all good? Thank you, Appreciate y'all. Appreciate you.